in this video lectures i will be covering the current affairs that is more relevant for esc 2021 prelims exam along with that the requirements of the civil service preliminary and mains and also railway management service if any is coming will also be covered we will discuss about the technical textiles so this topic was in news last year and in december 2019 some government decisions have come on technical textile sector and we got a question on technical textiles in last year prelims so that shows the importance of this topic why this topic is important because the technical textiles itself is sunrise sector in industrial development we will name some sectors as sunrise sector if it have potential to grow this it will be relatively new it will be involving new technologies relatively new sectors and it has potential to become big so when software industry started we used to tell it like a sunrise sector software and software enabled services we saw a boom and it changed the overall structural structure of the economy in many countries right so it is a potential rising industry understanding that government also has been encouraging the technical textile sector in india so first let us see what is this technical textile so normally we will use textile for clothing decorative aesthetic purposes etc but this technical textiles are prepared preferred for their technical performance and certain desired properties technical performance means it will find its use in different industries like automobile industry production industry healthcare industry etc and properties that make it attractive are like fire resistance chemical resistance relatively higher strength to their volume higher strength to their weight like that the properties will make it useful in the applications so accordingly 12 major segments are identified for application of the technical sector they have been named in various names like agrotech if it is used in agricultural purposes like making nets mulching material storage material extra fishing nets they are having more strength than other fabrics so it is called as agrotech and built tech if you are using in buildings using for canvases tents floorings scaffolding etc it is called as built tech so for demolition industry also this technical textiles will be used to cover the building so that no explosive materials no throwing out of materials will happen when the building is being demolished because of its strength it will be able to contain such explosion cloth tech cloth tech is used in normal cloth things but it will be having added advantages like breathable materials strength 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 materials for sweeps etc umbrella materials and some garments garments can be used this garments can be used as a smart textiles also they can sense different body parameters even heartbeat sweating rate so they can respond to the these parameters smart textiles is the advancement over the technical textiles geotex geotex will be used for controlling the landslides controlling the soil erosion so here and all geotechnical textiles will be helpful home tex it is for home needs like mattresses pillow covers carpets smart carpets which can be cleaned easily like those needs into tech means industrial will can be used in conveyor belts printing etc and meditex medical applications lenses surgical instruments packaging etc packaging of materials that can be resistive to chemicals resistive to radiations etc uh, desired qualities will be there mobility tech is used in automobile industry like in tires then using in airbags helmets and in 
aeronautical industries this will be helpful then okotech it is in environmental engineering for waste disposal environmental protection separate so it can be called as a separate branch of the geotex geotex is general term which can be used in geo geological engineering so if it is specially for environmental protection this okotech pack tech this packing materials wrapping materials disposable materials like different types of packing technologies are there protect protect is for protection bulletproof jackets fire resistant apparels chemical resistant apparels like those for protective devices can be made using these textiles sports tech sports is an important area of application using the strong materials we can produce sports materials like rackets balls nets etc pack tech mobility tech agro tech etc are the segments that are being widely used so the majority of applications is coming from this sector but other sectors also the use are slowly improving so to take up this opportunity to become a major exporter of technical textiles so indian industry is also industry is also trying to acquire this technology and speed up the manufacturing so what are the initiatives taken by the government technology mission on technical textiles technology mission on technical textiles was initiated in 2010 and it has been extended over another tenure also and recently what was the news steps have taken like almost 2207 products are given hsn codes Harmo harmonized system of nomenclature these codes will enable in export so each product will be given an unique code so that the product can be identified in international markets so it avoid any duplication or it avoid any confusion of each product so if you give this unique nomenclature for each product it can be identified and taxing invoicing like those things will be easier in the international trading so 207 products are given hsn codes and 92 areas are being identified for the using this technical textiles and the ministries have been advocated to use this technical textiles so across 10 ministries 92 areas for using this technical textiles has been identified and given instructions and ba standards are being developed for this technical textile products so that our products will get acceptability in international market also and courses are being introduced in skill development in skill development scheme skill skill india scheme courses are being identified for the technical industry so te the textiles ministry has a skill development program called samarth in that samarth courses are being introduced and mandatory local procurement many programs that are aimed to help the indigenous industry like solar cell manufacturing etc have mandated that at least 10 percentage of the products should come from local that is it should be procured from the local industries so this local procurement has been mandated for the technical textile industry also so the technical textile industry will develop indigenously so we have seen the different properties that make it useful like productivity which will help in performance this properties will help in performance for example productivity it will help to improve the productivity in agriculture it will help protection in military services and firefighters also firefighting and uh, chemical industries has other industries there also this protection is an aim strength the strength will help in application in transportation sports etc hygiene disposable products will products sanitary napkins etc will help in health care also government is encouraging that is an important point to note here and across different missions government is mandating the use of the technical textiles to improve the performance and productivity questions from this topic can come from any particular usage of a technical textile 
we have discussed the 12 segments so in any particular segment about the application there can be question or it can be about different government schemes that is encouraging this sector in civil service means you can expect exact type questions on what are the potential of the technical textile industry in india so you have to get the detail of the export share of this textiles what is the performance of the in Indian industries in global scenario. In future, what are the possible advancements and where or it can be improved like those details you need to understand. For more questions on this topic, please refer to the monthly hyperloop that is being published in our site.